Okay. So that, that's why. But um, we're Our going finals. right into the next one. Mm -hmm. John Numbers versus Jen. Um, not a uncommon uh, winner's finals at Xeno at all. Um, <laughs> however, though, uh, these players do go fairly back and forth. I think Jen has the overall Jen set. Jen had a perfect record on John last season. Wow. wow. That's nuts. No one has a perfect record on John. Yeah. Like, Especially someone who he has, like, played a lot before. That is kind of crazy. And, like, That's insane. Like, and you can see why, like, the first Hawks are already gone. Yeah, this matchup is hard, to be very clear. Um, <laughs> However, still, you, you know, there, there are things that Weaver can do. Obviously, Weaver Crouch is very good in the matchup. Yes. Weaver can space around certain things um, relatively well because of her speed. However, Palu definitely can oppress this character at ledge like a lot of other characters cannot. You died. That's huge. Oh, you didn't die. No, it's not on TNC for sure. Ooh, but the spacing was a little bit off. John was definitely tricky with the drift there to get back to stage. I mean, this is actually huge for uh, for Jen. This, this this lead he has, this extra credit he has on numbers right now yeah. is so good. And on TNC, the use of that yeah. extra platform is so good for him as well. For that extra distance he has on yeah. that explosive flame, on auto reticle, everything like that, on back air. Yeah, and that moment there where John died is kind of a pick your poison because you're like, oh, why did John di that um, explosive flame so poorly that he died off the top? If you DI out, you will also just die off the side in that position, you were just right? Dead. Yeah. Right, yeah. And like, although we are going to have to see. Nice. Okay, catch the two frame. That's really good. good. Um, we are going to have to see adaptation from John, however, though. No jump. No jump. He might just die. Okay, no. Yeah, Jen didn't want to extend on that, unfortunately. But I mean, he has a whole extra stuff to play with. It's, it's almost like, it's just. He could really play with his food right now if he really wanted to, but I yeah, doubt it. Yeah, the way that Jen plays is so. Don't, don't play with John. <laughs> Because he's he's gonna come play with He's gonna guy. hit you with some dumb some dumb stuff. Something dumb. <laughs> and then he's gonna hit you with four other dumb things. But yeah, oh. and then and then um when it when it comes to like like what Jen is doing just so well here, it's like again very similar to what I mentioned in the car flow set where Jen has just been passing every execution test in advantage. Um, doing the same here thus far with John. It's not even like Thanks for flying. Yeah. Like Jen obviously, like I don't need to tell you that Jen's neutral is really good. You can just like watch it yourself and see it. Okay, trying to go for a dare there did not end up hitting the timing. Oh, nice use of the crouch. <laughs> that's what okay, I'm saying. it actually worked. That's what I'm saying yeah. earlier. Crouch is actually very good versus Palette because a lot of her moves do not hit grounded opponents. Um, and we fit's crouch is one of the best in the game. So. I mean, it's almost like she just pancakes to the floor and yeah. just come, become completely level with the floor. Excellent parry. Excellent using uh, Eto to get rid of uh, the war the sun ball. charges. Um, they, they, they return, I know. It's your favorite part of the game. I know. Okay, up air? No, okay, not quite going to catch the lane. A little bit of spaghetti on both, uh, from both players there. A lot of defensive options coming out here from um, from Jen. I do expect an adaptation nice. from John on those. I, like, we've seen a lot of like double spot dodges, a roll and then a spot dodge from Jen on this last stock. Oof. That, that might no. traded. Wow, oh, that's wow. big for John. That's an like, insane this, trade. Like, obviously, still a really tough position to come back from. However, um, still possible. Oh, that was, yeah, yeah nice that's pressure. really that that's frustrating. Pressure. I imagine that's really frustrating for John because you you were at almost full shield here, and then rising Palu Nair poke shield like that's crazy. Yeah, rising Palu Nair poke shield that is kind of unfortunate. Um, it has to be frustrating because it's true comboed right into an up tilt, and you can see John's reaction here too. He's like, really, really. really? Oh. Stoic. Hmm. Oh, we're frozen? I didn't push pause. Hold on. Oh, Hold no, on. we're on the... Yeah. Okay. And you can see yeah, John's reaction here to instantly getting hit. Not happy. Lean back. back. Lean back like, in no. the chair. It's like, ugh, that's so annoying. <laughs> that's literally the... That's yeah. annoying. <laughs> Yeah. All right, here we go. Small battlefield. Okay. Because like John's shield was like almost full there. That, that, like that's yeah. like the right. Op that's that was a scary option from Jen. Okay. Yeah. Gotta go high. Gotta go. Did not want to get headers. That's active for like seven frames. It, it is active. That move. Okay. Nice. Dash attack on the ledge recovery by um, J uh, Jen. All right. Nair trying to get to the back here, but not fanning, unfortunately. Nice. Once and has, yep. has not been letting John get back with like jump aerial from Legend. Get hit, hit to there again. That time, though, John does it a third time and mixes it in with an air instead of the yep. forward air or the back air. And is able to get back at least briefly. Gets a lot of damage. Okay, not going to get the turnaround bear there. Ah, uh, this committed a little bit too much, and the was able to get that, uh, that, that, that fair. Another fair again. 
And the soccer ball? No, not yeah, it's oh, enough. Oh, it is taking it. Yeah, just barely. Damn. Hit up air on, on John's jump into center stage. No. Wasn't not going to hit. So flame, okay. not getting a down tone from, uh, from ledge. And uh, that's funny. <laughs> Jen, yo. I, that is super oh, funny. We're going to see if we throw that. Please, one, that. really good by Jen to just recognize yeah. the situation of what John's going to go for. Oh, um, that's so funny. Like, 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 like knows that John is going to go for a dash in. So just Incredible. instantly spot dodge into the uh, up smash is really, really good. That's so Big good. That, that's just, you just know Numbers yeah. is going to do that. Yeah, he opts for those uh, four. Those a lot. Yeah, and full combo right there for Jen is really big to get back into this game. Not going to be able to catch the tech roll in with the down air, not uh, reacting fast enough to that positioning. But percentages are essentially even down with a slight lead. Nice, that down tilt. I like that on the approach. Oh, no, but, no, down tilt, but that's right in the way of the, uh, the second ball. But great uh, rapid jump right there. Should be seeing another one. Oh, no, no auto radical. I know okay. but catching the roll, the long roll in. I am surprised that Jen did not hit that air dodge in. Okay. And numbers baiting out. Ooh, recovery yeah. and uh, baiting out the the drift back into F two. Yeah. That, and that, that's the thing that like Weaver Turner is so fast on the floor that like. Jen was drifting to get to ledge, and Weaver Jenner has the speed just to get over there and F tilt before Jen was even able to land. Okay, nice air dodge by John, and Ooh, nice, high, nice oh, high nice. recovery by Jen as well. And it gets the instant punish on the trump as well with the up air, mm -hmm. reading the DI in by John. Love the double da the double dash attack into the nair, into the second, uh, into another back air. Trying to counter possibly like the, a, a, the soccer ball. Yeah. That get up attack, yeah. Okay. Big damage coming out from John, though. This is good for John. Big punish. Oh, yeah. into, into the berry, not getting the F tilt. Parrying the soccer ball, thankfully. Yeah, John respecting the, the mash there. Mm -hmm. um, knowing that if he F tilts, does put Jen in a slightly better position on landing. Ooh, that almost true comboed right there. That would have been really... Ooh, that's, been, that's huge. I'm not sure that was meant to be a... Oh, that's shield break, yeah. I mean... That broke? Broke shield? <laughs> Why? All right. I mean, I know, I know that the move does that. Like, like Weaver Trainer header is really good against Shield. Shield was like I never mind. Shield was lo way lower than I thought it was. Uh, uh, Shield was really, really low. It was definitely just barely enough to break Shield. Um, yeah, I think the, the, the before with the um, the Sun Sao that he had blocked yeah. earlier. The Shield stun frames is, yeah. are what hurt uh, Jen there because obviously um, Shield size does not care about shield stun and how long you're in shield. It says you're still holding shield, so your shield is getting smaller. And obviously that is why the shield popped. So Jen, Jen was still stuck in shield, couldn't unshield in that position, right? Um, so yeah, in, in here, we have going right back to uh, small battlefield at the start. Uh, Jen, pretty notorious for running it back as well, so no surprise. Both these players are actually very notorious for just running just it back. back yep. um, okay, gonna get a punish there with uh, F tilt on dash attack, and that is going to be a nice punish for Jen. A quick 54% already onto John. Nice. Good to get down tilt into dash attack. Okay, what's the mix up? John just jumps to platform with a dare. Nice Gonna be able to get shield. back at least briefly here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like that he's uh, he's taking out these options from Jen, like nice. the dash attack bait and stuff like that. But Jen is able to kind of adapt and continue the the barrage. He's absolutely in that thing on numbers right now. And like the big thing there was like like great great recognition by nice. um, Jen. To know that uh, the first up tilt of Weaver Trainer is going to be negative, so you're going to be able to nair out. And now, Jen, because of that whole uh, interaction, is going to be able to get out of, um, you know, going to be able to keep John in disadvantage, right? Switch the position around. Oh, wow. Ooh, and John just I doesn't think, get yeah. back. It, uh, the, the threat of the nair mm -hmm. from the from the up B recovery allowed the Dunbers to just drift a little bit too far to the right away mm -hmm. from the ledge. Okay. Maybe I'll have too, too far in the and first th And this is almost a full stock lead for Jen. Obviously, John going to be able to, you know, bring this back pretty quickly if he finds the opening. But Jen really has not been giving John all that many openings at all. I'm liking the the more the use of the auto medical more more often in this matchup, especially when John is on the uh, off into the air where he usually is uh, more comfortable. That's an excellent use of the crowd. But nice aware yeah. from Jen to really ro to roll out of the situation before Ooh. it turns like an F tilt. I would have loved to see Dare come out there from Jen. Okay, but still, you're in an excellent position. You're up a 30% and a stock. Like, that is so huge. And, like, just maintaining center stage here is really the goal. Uh, John sort of baits in there. Um, nice. Uh, Jen going above 
that soccer ball there to get in there. Iron Trippin, and Trippin the deep breathing, so uh, numbers are not available to him right now. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, use, nice use in the back here to uh, get Jen a little bit off of him and give some more distance between the two characters. Just for that sun citation to come out. Okay, fair. Sour spot, and Jen is going to get back with that high up B. And now Jen has John in the corner. Not going to be able to. That long roll from Weaver Trainer coming in handy there. And a quick Sun Sal by John. Going to hit Jen. Okay. Jen has to get out of the corner again here. Great dash attack to get out. Reading John, um, you know, canceling the Sun Salutation. Nice. And I, nice, lo nice. I love the wait, not going for a full-on approach there. Because that's absolutely what John was expecting. The instant turnaround into the um, uh, into just like empty hop was so good. And, uh, to bait jump to do nothing to get dash attack there. Really big commitment. Thankfully, not able to, uh, able to get out of the situation with the recovery and not getting headed by numbers that he's looking for. But there is a, a, the fair instead to take out that first lock from Jen. Yeah, and Jen, uh, and Jen was reading jump, and John was very, very patient there. Mm-hmm. Okay, kind yeah. of extending off into the stage to see if he can down to the numbers. No, no two frame, unfortunately, and no backer on shield. Can we punish the deep breathing? Let's see. Oh, okay. Okay, he gets Phantom Footstool there, so it gets pretty high, but it does allow John to get back to the stage as well. A lot of shield damage right there scary. from John. Okay, back air beats out the dare there. Nice, and John um, gets past the um, the explosive flame, and is going to be right. able to get off a sun salutation. That's not going to be yet. enough just yet. No, again, the are not a ledge. Palo's, you know, back was strong, but not quite strong strong enough to kill these midweights like 150, 160 mark. That's no jump. Okay, yeah, you got to go high, but John's going to get a punish. Reset the ledge here. Me doing the high jump into okay. the uh, back here, absolutely taking that first stock. Oh, no, sorry, second stock uh, yeah. from numbers and. Could be seeing numbers bringing it right back, uh, returning the favor with that deep breathing still active on him. Considering and to go for these down airs, yeah. Like considering it was a full stock deficit, this is not a terrible position at all for John to be in. Um, you know, has made this like really big comeback thus far. Mm -hmm. um, you know, Jen has sort of um, missed out on a lot of big damage on the corner because John has started mixing up really well to get out of these corner situations. Nice, yeah. but Jen catches that one there, catches the ledge up jump. Yeah, and then we're starting to, to stop doing that, doing those sensation charges uh, during those Gosh. unsafe moments off, off from the stage you were seeing earlier in the set. Jen having to take, out, take care of that, uh, take control of center stage right now. Just yeah. get away from John as much as he can, but there's that grab into the forward throw. Not to get quite yet, trying to get the soccer ball as well. Thank thankfully, Jen does able to uh, go through it, but is not aware of the forward throw. Okay. Oh, that was nefarious. We, we zoomed, okay. Whoa, whoa, um, whoa, whoa. <laughs> so the big, the, the, the big spike hitbox right there coming out um, for John and sends oh, Jen wow, at a okay. wild angle who, who's DIing like straight out and died. Um, however, here, John, after you know starting off this game down by a lot, has basically made this game even again. However, getting caught right there, Jen hunting for that back air in that position, waiting for numbers to air dodge. Numbers, obviously, the air's a little bit more out whenever uh, he is hitting that down. Wow, so because you know that, that once time. you don't, you were going to get hit by that back air once more. Uh, once more, he is okay. looking for that back air, and numbers is waiting for it every single time. Like it's a contestant with his yeah, ball. Yes, yep. it. There it is. Yeah, tough Good positioning. Stuff. Missed a lot of those down to bears. Not even the bear part, but just down to well, down wasn't to. hitting it ledge right, mm -hmm. um, and hits it there. John was not ready to di out and exploded that time. Uh, Jen taking it over John, sending John to losers. So we're going to be seeing uh, Jen in Grand Finals. Yep. And this starts our descent into yep. the